Hello everyone, Grady Games here, and welcome back to another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, we are officially in epilogue mode. Uh, major spoiler alert, uh, if you did not complete the game, Arthur Morgan has finally perished after an epic uh, fist battle uh, with Micah Bell uh, on a cliffside. Uh, so we are officially playing as John Marston now, uh, and if you watched last episode, we are currently at... Uh, Pronghorn Ranch, uh, about to go speak to Tom Dickens, who is the overseer of the ranch, uh, but I, who knows how long this epilogue, epilogue is going to be, I'm sure, I'm sure a lot of people actually know how long this epilogue is going to be, this game has been out for uh, months now, but there is a lot of territory down here that I have yet to explore, uh, so I'm hoping that this epilogue takes us down that way, who knows? Who knows? We'll find out. We'll find out. Uh, but we are going to go speak to Mr. Dickens now. Uh, I'm sure he has some, like, handiwork for us uh, around the ranch. And then I forget the I forget the owner, uh, the owner's name. Uh, so we'll find that out as well. I think he was supposed to arrive. Oh. Oh, maybe that's the guy. That's his name right there. Geeds. Geeds? G-E-D-D-E-S. Geeds. Geeds? Who knows? We'll see. Maybe they'll say it here. Milton, get over here. Oh yeah, my name Mr. is Milton. Gettys, this is the new ranch Gettys. band I told you about. Well, I heard you had some Gettys. trouble with your welcome, but you kept your nerve and protected my property. No, it was nothing, sir. Mm -hmm. I'm David Geddes. Pleased to meet you. John, Jim, hmm. Milton. Ooh. Thank you uh -oh. for the opportunity, sir. You and Mr. Dickens. Well, you work hard. He'll to remember be honest, that. You'll get your keep. I promise you that. Boy has a family. Oh, lucky man. Then you better work extra hard. Good day, Howdy, sir. gentlemen. Sir. You hear that, John Jim? Extra John hard. Jim. Hey, hey, get over here. Mr. Dickens? Go find old Jim Milton here something to do. Make sure he works extra hard. Sure, Mr. Dickens. Ooh, that's like a that's like a telltale game right there. He'll remember that. A man Come doesn't forget his way. own name. I, I was on my chores anyhow. Say, is that your family getting in the wagon up there? Ah, oh, believe it is. Mind if we go welcome them? Not at all. Hey, is it true what they said about you when you arrived? That, that you ran off those hired guns? Look, can we uh not discuss this in front of my wife? Oh, uh, no, sure. Yeah, of course, mister. I don't want to worry her. Oh, yeah. I hear that. Hello, family. Good, honest work. Mrs. Milton! Jim Milton. How fine you seem. This kind man just collected us. Thank you, sir. I think we can be okay here. It's ranching work. This place is kinda... It's fine. But I hear you began your career in ranching by throwing your weight around. Real <laughs> wise, Jim. What was I supposed to do? The place was getting robbed. So you show everyone who's boss? Real fine. I didn't have much of a choice. I gotta go. Jack, when you're done in here, come on out and lend a hand. Well, there went that secret. I was going to milk the cows. Come on, I'll do it. You? I'll do it. I'll do it. Are gonna milk the cows? Sure. <laughs> Why not? Oh, uh, I don't know. I, I thought you was. Uh, you don't have any faith in my cow milking abilities? A new one at that. When you got here, them hired guns? I was just getting my wagon back. That's all. Weren't nothing. Oh, it weren't nothing. It's about time someone stood up to them fellers. No. Oh. Where are you from anyway, partner? Well, you know, up north, mostly. Been in these parts before, but that was years ago. Oh, <laughs> it's changed. The rich fellas are coming in and buying everything, the ranches. But, well, it ain't as wild as it once were, at least. There is that. See, if it ain't too personal a question, are you a gunslinger, mister? Good lord, no. Nothing like that. Now, just a ranch hand then. Just a ranch hand. 
failed at a bunch of things, like most men. <laughs> well, I feel a whole heap better having a ranch hen like you around. That is for sure. <laughs> Let's see how you feel once you see me work. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. Here's the cows. All right. I got this going. Yeah, we used to have a bunch of women here did most of the milking. Yeah, but most of them drifted off. Okay. You fine with milking? You know, I ain't really done much of it. Could never, never really get the hang of it. You serious, mister? Sure. It's Jim. Jim Milton. Hey, sit down, I'll show you how. Approach her calm now. She don't take too kindly to surprises. I, I wouldn't either, pal. Is this... Oh my gosh. Is this what the epilogue is? Alright. Left. Right. Left. Right. Left. You got the hang of it. Almost I know how to do it. Full. Damn, that cow filled that up real quick. Damn. This cow's got a lot of milk. Is that unusual? Sure, Abe, Lancelot. Well, hey, Lancelot. Hey. Is this cow all right? We're going to make a dairy maid of your paw yet. <laughs> I never oh, I thought fucked I'd it up. see the day. Watch and learn, partner. We all got to earn our keep. Did I mess this up? That's three full buckets full. Is that how much cows right, usually put boy, out? Uh, help me clean out the stables. Sure. Come on, son. That cow might be sick, guys. You, now, you might want to well, might want to check on that cow, guy. It's such a fine name. I like it. I got I got imaginative parents, sir. <laughs> I can tell. Now it ain't pleasant work, but it's got to be done. Mr. Dickens said. I know what he said. We'll do it, won't we, boy? Mm-hmm. I can I can make this place spick and span, pal. Okay. Well, you get them stalls cleaned out, and I'll see you later. Bye. Okay, Jack. Let's just try and take some pride in this work, hard as it may be. Boy, bring that wheelbarrow over here and keep it close to me. Yes, sir. Lance a lot. All right, here we go. Coming. How do I do this? Okay, there we go. You're Pick up. Long oh, way great. From Angelo Bronte's mansion now. Sorry, sir. Nothing. Ugh. That's great. <laughs> That's great. This is what Guns my life has become. Shit shoveling. Great. This is what I got. We should have gone back for the money. Hey, boy! I told you to keep this close to me. Come on, Almost Jack. Got me. I mean, Lance a lot. Oink, oink. He didn't hear me. Oh. Well, this is this is convenient that I didn't have to do all of them. Oh, I do have to do this last one now. John Marston, the terror of the turds. <laughs> All right. What the hell? Return the pitchfork. No, it's my pitchfork. Say we're almost done here. You finish things up. I'll go check on her. Okay. Lance. <laughs> All right. To Abigail. I have a feeling those guys are gonna come back here. They were embarrassed last episode. Me in. Abigail, please don't yell at me. You always yell at me. Hey. Hey. Where's Jack? Shoveling shit in pursuit of the better life you want. Same as I've been. Won't do him no harm. I know. Guess maybe we can last here. Survive. Do a little better than survive for once. I'm tired of fleeing, John. So, well, you know. 
Me too. Aww. We need to go, we need to find that money. There's still money in Blackwater, I would assume. I'll put some coffee on. <laughs> Back at it, day number two. Oh, I got three dollars. Oh man, I only have fourteen dollars and sixteen cents. This is some BS. I'm broke. Gentlemen, howdy. Morning. Hi, Mister. All right, we got two missions on the map now. Who is this guy? Okay, that's uh for uh, Geddes. Did I say that right again? I feel like I said it incorrectly. Um. Okay, so we got Tom Dickens. Let's go speak to, uh, let's go speak to David. I don't know, I have no idea why I just marked it. As if I'm gonna get lost on the ranch. Oh man, just force a habit, I guess. Damn, where is this dude? Where are my other hands? Damn it, Abe. Abe? Mr. Geddes. You got an answer for me? Mr. Geddes, I... I said, Abe, yes, where are the other hands? Uh, I thought I said I don't rightly know, Mr. Getty, sir. Well, what good is that to me? We got three horses lost, possibly more, a mare about to full, sir, and no hands to help with any of it. I'm supposed to be heading into town. This place is chaos. Hey, Pa! Can I get some help? Pa! Milton, Milton, you good with horses? I'm okay. I'll do whatever needs doing, sir. Good man. Can you help my boy, my youngest, Duncan? He will insist on riding Jeremiah, a horse that is far too strong for him. And my wife will need help with this mare. Abe? Sir? You and Dickens better not make any more mistakes like you did today, you hear? No, sir. Thank you. Both of you. Oh, shit. Abe, you better watch yourself. Come on, he's over here. I'm good. You get on. Go find them horses. No, no, no. I'll show you. Since you showed up. Runaway horse has been to some of our problems, and I am thankful for that. I ain't done too much. I ain't much of a rancher. Oh, heck. Hey, maybe them Laramie boys weren't so tough after all, huh? Maybe I could have handled them. Of course you could. They're just loud mouths. <laughs> so, uh, is that what the boss is doing in town? Some business with them boys or something? Oh. When Mr. Geddes goes into town, well, it ain't exactly for, uh, business. Oh. Uh, okay then. All right. He'll be just at the end there. Well, I better get to. Thanks, kid. All right, yeah, thanks, Abe. Appreciate it, bud. Hey, Cal. Come here, Cal. Can I ride this Cal? No. Cannot ride Cal. You Duncan? I'm Jim. Jim Milton. Hey. Need a hand with that horse? No. Whoa. <laughs> you sure about that? Okay, yes. Yes, I do. Pretty big one. <laughs> That's Jeremiah. Hey, now. Okay, Jeremiah. Hey, I know how to calm a horse. Good morning, friend. Settle down, okay? <laughs> Easy. Come on. Easy, boy. Oh. Come on, now. Someone put some onions on their oats, didn't they, boy? Oh, calm down. He likes you. I ain't sure he likes any of us, but I'll make him respect me and behave. Can't you teach me how to make him behave same way as he does for you? I'm supposed to go help your mother. She's got a horse in full. That'll take hours. Well, training a horse can take hours. Just give me a quick lesson, sir. Please. Okay. Let me ride him a bit first. Get some of the spunk out of him. I'll be in the corral, man. Uh, there sure. Go. All right, come on, big fella. Oh, I got to deplete his stamina. All right. Come on. Let it all. 
do a uh, do a quick uh, trip here. This might actually this Come might take a while. On. Where's that big mean horse? Eh, it's not gonna take that long. Let's get just do a little wrap around here. Oh shit! Watch it! Oh shit! <laughs> took my eyes. Took my eyes off the prize. You got some energy. Show me then. Maybe I shouldn't gallop through the uh, ranch at full speed. I'm gonna hit somebody. Everything you got. Come on. They're gonna fire me. Oh, Can't afford to lose boy. it. Lose the job. Gonna give us no trouble now. All right, where you at, son? How do I get in there? Ah, uh, here we go. Cows, how are you? You heard All about right. my milking skills, have you? He's ready for you. Okay. Get on up there and go nice and slow. <laughs> Good luck to you, son. He's gonna buck him off. Stay calm. Me? The horse. You're calm. My heart's beating a little. Keep your voice calm and your legs strong. Don't let old Jeremiah sense fear. I won't. Doing fine. Real nice. Not that I'm saying you need one, but you sure there isn't another horse? You ride around here? I had a pony, but I'm too grown for him now. Yeah? You think my son could borrow him? Huh? Lancelot? Yeah. Sure. I'll get it hitched by your cabin there. All right. Thank you, son. Can I ask, are we in trouble from all these Laramie boys? They say Mr. Abel's real rich, way richer than Pa, and he's got all these hired guns out of Laramie, and if Pa doesn't sell, well, they'll come here and they'll... Hey, easy there. You don't have to worry about all that. You just worry about Jeremiah there. Yeah, but... But... Just worry about the horse, yeah? Yes, sir. I think you two might be ready to go out without a chaperone. Oh, I'm not sure about that. You're good. Nice and easy now. Both of you. Okay, um... Now what? <laughs> you Mr. Milton? I'm getting dizzy. I thought you were gonna help me. I am. I was. I'm sorry. Come on. I need a man's help. Yeah, Nothing. I'm coming. What have I told you about distracting the hands? I'm sorry, Mom. <sighs> well, I hope you'll listen to me better than my Thank husband. You, Mr. Milton. You're doing fine. Hey, wait a minute. Kid. That gate was just locked. Give him a carrot when you put him down. It's over here. Man, she is power walking. Damn, lady. Oh, are we gonna witness the miracle Milton? of birth? So, I'm ready. You know much about birthing a foal, Milton? Not too Hell much. No. Oh my God, where does my husband find men like you? Still, we all know where he goes in town, and it ain't hunting for hands. It's not too hard. You just uh, stick a hand in there and get a feeling for where the legs are. Go on. <laughs> you say, man. All right, guys. Uh, this may not be very PG thirteen. Okay, <laughs> I'm fine. Out. I got the legs. Got him. There we go. Okay, now, hold on. Wait, what Can just happened? Again? Come on. And pull. Oh, pulling. I'm pulling. I'm pulling. <laughs> okay. Well, I think she's. Well, we're not out of the woods, but I think she may be okay. Great. We'll make a proper hand of you yet, Mr. Milton. I hope so. Thank you. Oh, and Mr. Milton, feel free to make a call at the house sometime. Perhaps even now. A drink to toast our new arrival. <laughs> I'd like that, I'm but married, my wife is expecting me back. Oh, you're married? I didn't know we had any married hands. Yeah. We 
We have a boy. Maybe you've seen him around? Oh, uh, I'm, I'm busy. Uh, too busy for social calls. Of course. Good day, <laughs> Mr. Milton. Oh, she was trying to... All right, interesting, uh, interesting power couple here. The husband goes off to Strawberry uh, to do some to do some horn, and uh, the lady is getting it on with all the hands. That's gonna be an interesting dynamic, I guess. Yeah, I don't need no gates. I cannot be confined by gates, and fences. Twenty-two stamina. How did I do that? Holy hell! Abigail, you'll never guess what happened. Hey, John. Jim. <sighs> Sorry. So, this is what you wanted. Fake names, which, by the way, Dickens sees clean through. John. Us on the run. John, this is our chance to make something new. Come on. Please. For me. For him. How's he been? He's been kind of withdrawn. Quiet. You know. Sure. Take him out, please. Like, kill him? Come on, boy. Let's go for a walk. Oh, you meant... Come on. Okay. Got it. Sorry, Abigail. I'm glad we cleared that up. Could have been dangerous. Well, it's lucky we got him a horse right before this. Very coincidental. Why am I walking? Left. Nope. What do you see? Pony? Get on him. We're taking a ride. Don't that's a, that's a rather large pony. Or maybe not. I don't know. Let's go. Uh, Abigail, get in the house. How you doing? Abigail, you are not Fine. decent. Can we go home? Get in the house. No. You're... Stay calm. Where would you like to go riding, aside from home? I don't know. But maybe that stream? Good idea. Now you know all this. Abigail out there in her nightgown. Come on. With all those you know. thirsty ranch hands out there. Not gonna, the none of this is gonna end fear. well. Just act confident, okay? Uh-huh. Confident. Yep. Hey, hey. Don't pull Not that on the confident. Reins. You'll yank his bit out. Use your legs. There you are. There's beautiful land going. up here, at least. Jack, a little kick and a. Uh. Okay. Control is speed. Go faster. See, you can do it. <laughs> How about you speed up a mic? Okay. Whoa. He may get bucked off his no, horse. Alright, it's slower. It Whoa, boy. Well then why would I ever want to go faster if he's gonna get bucked off? This is a good this is a good pace. I think he's doing all right. Beautiful, absolutely. That's the uh, that's the uh, ranch over there, the O'Driscoll Ranch, where uh, Arthur Morgan and Sadie Adler shot it up. Such a beautiful game. I guess I don't understand the point of telling him to go faster or slower. All right, go fast. Why don't we beat it up again? <laughs> okay. Come on. Yeah. There you go. How could he? I don't think he'd get bucked off at this speed, right? He's not going very fast. Even faster, come on. Okay, faster? now I'm pushing it. That's fine, right? Okay. Let's go across to the stream. Hey. Oh shit. <laughs> I didn't say stop. Yes, oh, uh, I'm going the wrong way. Oh, there's a deer there. Look at that thing. Or, uh, no, that's a, um, 
Shit, what is that thing called? Pronghorn. Doe. Here we are. Yep. We should get back. You think you're ready for a little race? I guess. All right. We go back to the path and up to the ranch. Okay. On my go. Go! Oh, okay. You little shit. Hey, you said we're going back to the track. I'm on the track. I went back to the track. Hey, come back here. Mm -mm. You have to catch me. Guys, this is not smart racing. Should I let my son win? Nah. And you're much smaller. Like a jockey. Come on, Jack. You're disappointing me. Oh shit. <laughs> I got the hang of this, sir. Alright, I'll let the boy win. Wink, wink. Although I'm very highly competitive and this is hurting me. Yeehaw! We gotta fill him with confidence. Last straight. He's been a lot he's been hey, withdrawn I recently. Abigail better not be out here in her nightgown though. It's gonna be I would be very upset. I beat you! I beat you! I Well beat... ridden, son. <sighs> I beat you. Like I said, your riding has gotten so much better. Thanks. Hey, keep practicing your riding. You too. You need it. <laughs> you little shit. You little shit. to work today myself, Jack. Huh? So you stay out of trouble. Where are you working? I told you. I'm cleaning at the doctor's office. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> Give the place a tidy. Okay, Pa. I'll see you later. All right. Uh, cool. So another three dollars. Another day. Another three dollars. Uh, so that's where I'm going to leave things off here, guys. Uh, we have a uh, Tom Dickens uh, mission to get to here on the map. Some more ranch handing. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy the episode, please definitely drop a like and a comment below. And while you're at it, go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well. I do put out daily gaming videos, so be sure to do that uh, so you don't miss anything. And I will see you guys on the next episode.